Hey guys, this is Elle. Welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be me taking a trip basically to Target. I wanted to do a Target doll haul and see what's out there in order for me to buy some new either fashions or just dolls in general. Uh, what I really wanted to get out of this trip was some new fashion packs for my Mycene dolls. If you guys saw that video where I actually reviewed the Made to Move dolls and rebodied some of my Mycene dolls, you noticed that I was using some of the fashions from the actual Mycene line, which are a bit dated, so I wanted something new to spice up their wardrobe, and I thought this is a perfect way to do it. And I wanted to bring all of you guys along so that you guys could see what was available at the actual physical stores, and maybe you guys would want to pick up some of the stuff that I find. So now let's just get right into it and hit up that target and see what we can find. Okay, so here we are bright and early at Target. Let's go in and hopefully there's not a lot of people around. This is why I come early in the morning. And now let's make our way to that toy aisle. And what is gonna be our first stop? We should probably go into, um, there it is, the Barbie aisle. So looking at all this stuff, it's everything I've basically seen online. It doesn't look like anything new is out here. I'm not really into any of these Barbie Playline dolls. Um, I feel like their fashions are very, very plain and just not exciting. What do we have here? So I have a bunch of play sets. Let's see. I've seen this online and I love the jacket. It's really, really cute. I'm not a fan of the pet. Um, and those shoes, oh, uh-uh, no way. That is like a sensible heel. I will not be doing that. Let's see what else we have here. That yoga doll is cute. She has an other um, older articulated body. Oh, we have this fashion pack, but I'm not into this mix of polka dots and that shiny purple dress. It's definitely not my style. What else do we have here? Oh, this seems interesting. I like the dress, but I'm not into those little 2D type of stickers. They look a little bit too childish for my taste, but the dress is cute. Ooh, 138. I have to pick him up later on online. Um, I do really want him. And let's see what else is down here. He's cute. I've seen him before. I've seen her before as well. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing any, obviously, of those new fashionistas that we just saw the pictures leaked of, so I definitely will be waiting for Oh, I like that skirt, but the rest of the dolls are not very cute. Uh, what else is going on here? Uh, those two are cute, the unicorn girls, but definitely not my cup of tea. Firefighter. Ooh, she's cute. She has a very cute face mold. I might have to pick her up later. More made to move dolls. I definitely have to pick up some of those for more of my my scenes, but I definitely need to pick up more of the white Barbie and the mid tone Barbie for a lot of the girls. Yeah, but the rest of these don't seem to be, oh, definitely not color reveal. I am definitely not a fan of these. I don't understand how it won doll of the year, but I mean, what else is on this end cap? More made to moves. And yeah, she has a really cute face. I really am enjoying that tinsel in her hair and those foil highlights on her cheeks. Very cute. More Barbie extras. Oh, I really wish I, I really wish she had another made to move body and not that old articulated body because she's cute. But yeah, I definitely won't be picking her up. Rainbow High. Let's see what's at Rainbow High. I basically have everything that Rainbow High has already. So I definitely don't see anything new. Yeah. Fail fix, no. They're cute. I just don't like their fashions. I wish their fashions were a little bit more chic and I definitely would be picking them up. Uh, play sets. I definitely don't like the play sets for Rainbow High either. I, it, I think they just take up too much room and I definitely don't enjoy them as much as, you know, other little kids would. Oh, how cute. She's so cute. A na 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 surprise girl. Very cute. Obviously that's not her price, $9.99. Or else I would have picked her up. Okay, LOL surprise dolls, not into those. Let's see what else is here. Pop BB, the 
old LOL OMG girls. If you guys didn't have a chance to check out my LOL OMG dance 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 review, definitely do that. Oh god, these stalls, no. And there's so many of them. Are these even selling? Oh my god. They're kind of scary looking actually. And for all of you Disney princess fans, there is an entire aisle of that. They are not my, you know, preference, but I know that a lot of people are into these. They are very cute though. They're just not my thing. Uh, let's see what else do they have down here. Oh, these are so cute. Look at those cute faces. Adorable. Oh, look at the Moana. She's so cute. So as you may have noticed, I did not really find anything at the store. I really looked for different pieces and thought, you know, what can I actually buy right now uh, so that I don't have to make this trip, you know, and not have it produce anything. And basically, I didn't find anything. Everything that I saw there, there was like one piece in a fashion pack that I maybe liked, but then the rest of it was kind of a throwaway. So I didn't also want to spend my money on something that I did not like. So I actually went online to see if there was anything newly listed on all the different sites. And I actually did come up with some better options than the stuff I saw at the actual store, which is kind of crazy because I always figured that there would be more options at the actual store. But here are some of those options that I found. Loving that jean jacket with a pink fur collar and also love that pearl necklace. Also love this wide brim hat and the clear jelly-like bag with a leopard print, so cute. Also digging this Ken Fashionista pack for Barbie for an oversized casual look. I've also been following some really, really cool doll designers and they actually offer some really, really good options that are way better than what's online and at the actual physical stores as far as doll fashions are concerned. So I will be putting their names up on the bottom of the screen and definitely go check them out because they have some really good stuff. I definitely have to pick up some of those fashions myself. I'm already in contact with one of them to get some of their cute, cute jumpsuits I just saw go up on his Instagram. So I cannot wait for that. If you guys are also interested in his fashions, definitely go over to his Instagram and check him out and buy them ASAP because those things sell out fast. And like always, please remember to smash that like button, subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my future videos, and please share this video with all your friends. It really does help me out a lot. In addition, please remember you can follow me on Instagram with the name mendozagram.art, where you can see all my completed fashion sketches, cool doll photography, and be able to participate in questionnaires that will lead to new content on this channel. And like always, I will see all of you in my next video.